Hi, this is Bini from Online Forex Master. Thanks for joining us. Today, what I'd like to do is I'd like to share a trade that was done in the alien room. All right, the trade is a uh, pound dollar that I wrote about it on the 14th of September. All right, um, what I like to do is I like to share my thoughts and ideas in the alien room um, to my members and they can use it. So some of them are working professionals, some of them are housewives, some of them are full-time traders, right? So we are busy with our work and we like to have a little bit of a reinforcement of what we understand of the market. So here, that's the purpose of sharing my thoughts, all right? To bring them to a trade that they can focus on and what they need to do is to focus on making money all right now what i said is that pound dollar trapped between support and resistance zone um, i'm more bearish and tomorrow will be bank of england um, rate decision so it will be a high impact news right now um risk level is a level that is a um, level that allows you to do certain um, limit order that means that today you know this level and you'll be written in advance right you know about this level and you could either put in a limit order the day before or hours before and this is like a set and forget level now the nice things about risk level uh, from the alien room is because it's a make or break level and is a very very important level all right so if we get it right you're gonna get explosive trades from here and if we get it wrong all right then your stop loss will be minimal because it's a risk level okay now of course uh, what we emphasize in will be on close all right so I also write here all right what would be a good trigger for a confirmation trade, all right, and the price will be a day close below 13170. Now, R will be the strong resistance level that can be used as a stop loss, and S in this case because we are shorting, so S will be a support level that can be used as a take profit level, and all these are all listed for you, all right. So, we are taking profit at um, 1.31 even, and of course, the level that we must lock means that the level that you need to take profit will be 1.2950. Now, all these are written on the 14th of September. All right. Now, I don't only want to give my trade ideas, but I also want to share my trade analysis with my members. All right. So here's my trade analysis to give reason why. So the next time you could do it on your own. And that's very important. You learn, you follow, as well as you need to get empowered. So next time you can do it on your own. All right. Now let's have a look at what happened to this trade. Remember a few things. We are going to sell limit at 1.3 to 20 to 30. That's the first level. Second, we're going to lock the first level at 1.31 even and must lock 1.2950 and the post is, was posted on 14 September. Hi, now we are at the chart of pound dollar. Um, right now you are seeing the H1 chart. Now usually in the alien room, we are showing a H4 chart or a day chart or a week chart because when you trade into the higher time frame that's where you get your monster peaks and that's where you get explosive trades all right so few things to recap risk level 1.3 to 20 30 all right this means that we are looking to sell limit around this area here all right now lock 1.31 now if we are successful in locking the trade at 1.31 even that means we're probably going to end up with a 120 to 130 pips profit now if we're going to lock at 1.2950 then that means we're going to have about 260 to 280 pips all right now what i mark here will be 14th of september see 14th of september here and that's the day i made the post and that's the day um i let my members know about that now it makes sense to short into pound dollar because what we can see is that we can see a very nice downflow here followed by a very nice retracement all right and a very nice downflow here and what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to catch the tipping point of this retracement 
right? Now, when you catch a tipping point of this retracement, you're gonna get in at the almost the make or break level, the best price with just a little bit of a stop loss, okay? Now, so this is 15, 14th of September, all right? Then we move on to the 15th of September, you're gonna find that the first entry of a sell limit is gonna come up into here, okay? Now this is the first entry of a sell limit. Now once we show here, we put in our stop loss at the highest point around here. Now price move down, but bear in mind in the post, I also caution it must close below 1.3170, all right? And we see no close below this, and that's the reason why price doesn't move. Now the second time we can have another one more sell limit inside here one more opportunity to sell into this zone all right and we are done we are filled in on all our position at 1.3225 average okay next very important when you are in a trade you need to know where to lock and put money inside your pocket now Two levels to look out for, 1.31 even and 1.2950 are the two levels that are written down. Now you will take probably quite some time for you to find out these levels. So what we, off we, are, what we are offering right now is a convenient service. Of course, we still emphasize that there is a need for you to understand and we document that in our charts and in our learning material, how to look for target profit. All right. Now what I did in the chart is to mark out the two levels here. One is 1.31 even. That's the first level that we are looking at. And the second level will be 1.2950. Now note that this trade has already been concluded. That means we have already locked our profit and exited this trade at the time of recording. I'm just doing it to let you know how we are trading in the alien room. All right. So now one thing to emphasize is take a look at the amount of reads. Take a look at the amount of reads, all right, that if you are shorting into 1.230, reward and reads, that's what every trader will be concerned about. Now let's look at the reward and reads of the pound dollar trade that we put in. Now we shorted at an average price of 1.3220 and 30 around this price here look at the blue line now our stop loss will be at the top here that will bring us to a stop loss of around and not more than 50 pips all right now if you look at the potential um tp which is 1.31 even that means that you're gonna have a potential profit of 130 pips all right to a reward of 130 pips and a possible stop loss of 50 pips now this trade has a minimum reward to risk ratio of 2 is to 1 that's perfect now we talk about the next level that we need to lock which is at 1.2950 all right now that's about 260 pips from our entry level now 260 pips will be the reward and 50 pips will be the stop loss that means to the second target profit the reward to risk ratio will be approximately four times all right now to every dollar that you're going to reach you have the chance to earn four dollars right this is a very good reward to risk trade now the outcome all right price moves because the market starts to talk about that brexit reality starts to come true now we had the first level reached and where we lock in at 1.31 all right and price started to move again before it retracing all right now it's okay because it never reached into the 1.31 uh, level that we took profit and finally after another one more days and two more days of movement it reached into the 1.2950 and we lock into our position fully so we took profit on this trade exactly at 1.2950 you're gonna see 1.2950 is very reactive because price actually bounce up now if you do not take your profit at 1.2950 now that's also means that your reward or your potential gain for this trade would be lesser all right now what we do at the alien room is to provide you with all these levels 
Alright, so that you're gonna do what you are good at and you're gonna focus on what you are good at which is to make money from trading. Alright, thanks for joining me for this session. I love to share a lot of great trades but in the meanwhile, see you in the alien room.